Hello guys, mdog123 here, and welcome back to Minecraft Snapshot 15w32c. Woo! So... Peace. so, today we are going to be obviously going through the snapshot. So unfortunately last week I did miss the snapshot before that. Um, I did have microphone issues and that was kind of my fault. So I'm sorry about that. But let's get straight into it. So the first thing we have is the new endstone bricks. Um, they're pretty much just bricks um, made out of endstone. And it's just like it's just a block we need. Next we have the purper blocks which were created specifically for the new end dungeons that we will see later on in the snapshot. Then we have the purper pillars. And I believe there currently is no crafting recipe for this. And of course we have the stairs in the slabs. We also have a new mob which is called the Shulker. If I attack it and let's do game mode zero here. You can see they're going to go boom and shoot these little like homing thingies at me. That just missed. But this, these won't. And it makes you start floating up into the sky. Um, so that is a pretty cool effect. As you, and now we have levitation. As you can see in the upper right hand corner. Up here there was potion effects. Which we should hopefully see more about. Next we have the new beetroot crop. Which as you can see there's seeds. You can place it down. Um, I believe there's no current. I've heard you can hoe grass. But I haven't been able to actually test that yet. So yeah. And when it breaks, apparently it's not, or no, that's not why. Um, but it's, we do get these beetroot crops. And yeah, so now if we do a bowl as well, we can make beetroot soup. And let's just change this real fast. Come on, game. So you can see here, we can make a beetroot soup. I believe it's like this. This, this, no. Yeah, like this will make you a beetroot soup. So now, if we go ahead and take a shovel, um, any type of shovel will work. And you right-click, you make this new path block, which is pretty cool because it's um, it may replace the gravel. It, I think it personally will just depend on what's currently happening like where you are putting this path or not next we have the ender dragon head which you kill by defeating the ender dragon um if you put it with a redstone signal and apply it it moves its head and if you put it on your head come on and you walk around with it you can see it's moving around so that is pretty cool next we have these are not technically new blocks but they're new glass and now it's not that big ugly four-sided thing um, and now we also have these iron bars. All right, so next we have all of the arrows. Which is a new arrow type pretty much for all um, potions available in the game. Arrow of invisibility, leaping, fire resistance, um, swiftness, poison, anything like that. So, But one of the most important things that I'm going to show you guys is um, the spectral arrow. So let's go ahead and let's spawn a mob. Ooh, what to spawn? We'll just spawn a slime. I don't know why. Not. And we're in peaceful crap. And I just realized the shulkers did not disappear in peaceful. Anywho, so if we shoot this slime with the spectral arrow, that's a new p effect. And now you can see, we can pretty much see it through blocks. So it's a pretty cool way to just make um the slime like you be able to see the slime in with players if they're on a team it will change different colors as well and then yeah all right so after that new spectral arrow we also have this command and let's see if i can get it right yes there we go so um if you can do f the switch between the offhand but if i do this correctly no okay um Um, well, if I did do this correctly, which I'm not, crap. 
if I if you point at the top of the block, which I'm sort of doing right now, but sort of not, you can see kind of that. Um, you can nerd pillar up now. I, I'm doing this wrong now, which is weird. Why I don't know. Anyways, you're able to nerd pillar up. Um, so yeah. Um, and then if we do like an ender pearl, bring this into the game. And we can't do anything else. It will prioritize the uh, offhand if it can do something if you can't do anything with your main hand. Which you can also switch to the left side if need be. Now there's also one new thing, another new thing, which is an ender rod. Which at the current moment in time, there's only like the up in the top. There's no like middle. You can't do a middle. Which is interesting. But, you know, oh well. Anyways, let's hop into the end now. Alright, so now there is one important thing that if you do spawn on the Enderman now, his towers are protected by cages, um, and he will actually protect them now. But, at the moment in time, I feel this stuff is more important to talk about, so let's get on with this. So these are the new chorus plants. If you just get it and break it, it will break down into all these little chorus fruits, which you, if you eat, which you cannot do here, let's go zero, it will teleport you like an enderman pretty much, which could be bad if you're not paying attention and walk off the edge. Now you can also get popped chorus flute, fruit, which I have no clue how to craft yet, um, but hey, you know, anyways, now there's also these chorus, um, flowers, which you get off the top, these little thingies right here. If you get those off, if you climb up with a pickaxe and break those off, you can put them around. And they'll actually start growing up like these. So you can make a pretty cool chorus um, flower plant farm if you would like to. So next we have these ender dungeons. And as you can see, they're using the new purple blocks, um, purple stained glass, and end stone blocks, and end rods as well. So if we go through here. You can see, going through the front engine, shulkers on either side. Just go up through and explore. And there you go. Parkour, I guess, right here. Come up out of the edge. Shulkers up here. Um, cool banners. And yeah, also if you go over to these little ships that do spawn with dungeons, you see there's another one over there. Um, they look kind of like this. You have these end rods around. I just got speed from the speaking. Which will be removed from the game according to Jeb. They were just there for testing. And you get some pretty sweet loot. Like Fortune 3, Efficiency 4. That's a really good pickaxe to have. Or Respiration 3, Protection 4 is still great to have on hand. So, that has pretty much been all the changes. Um... In the new Minecraft 1.9 snapshots, I hope you guys enjoy. Check out next week for the next snapshot, and I hope to see you all soon. Goodbye! Yeah.